What's up guys? I'm back. My hair is quite weird, but whatever. We're back in the Arsenal jersey with my glasses on because it's another Arsenal video. This is episode two of the Arsenal Return to Glory video, <laughs> I guess. Um, again, this is completely unscripted, just like any other video I make. Um, yeah, I'm recording it in the night because it's the only time I get, but yeah, we will head back into where we started. So we have Villarreal. What? <laughs> okay, they sent Tammy Abraham. That's quite weird. Um, okay. Wait, what? Come on. No! Oh, I think that was a player that we wanted us. Wait. Forget I said anything, I completely forgot that we were managing Arsenal. <laughs> I completely forgot that we signed Kamara for Arsenal and I was confused. I legit thought that <laughs> we weren't playing for Arsenal and I, I'm like, wait, I want Kamara. Uh, what a blooper right there. No, that was just dumb of me. But anyways, this is how the team is looking like. Uh, again, it's not the best team, but I mean, it's, it's a team, it, it's coming together. Um, Martinelli, I really want to incorporate him a little more. Uh, I think he'll be a really good player. Probably. Katia could also be a good player. I think we might sell Lacazette, honestly. Or maybe, yeah, I was going to say maybe a Batman, but not. Nah. Anyways, these are the players that we have. These goalkeepers seem pretty decent. Uh, Jay Harrington and G. Tate Lee, I think. Uh, pretty good potential for both of them. Charles Shields just does not look like a good player. And Brower, also nope. No, that's fine. Um, Tommy Bates, nope. And Googleman, or what? Googleman Go yeah. from Liechtenstein. Strange. Yeah. These players all have decent end potential. Ooh, Francisco Redondo. I'm gonna promote him, honestly. Ooh, he looks good, too. <laughs> the stats, huh? Alright, anyways. Sorry, I should be a little more active because you guys are actually seeing me and everything. I'm just quite tired, honestly, to be fair. Um, but, yeah. We're starting our first ever um, Burnley matches. Burnley matches? Premier League matches. I am just not in the right mind at the moment, I'm just so tired. Mm. Uh, my sh damn, the sharpness for these players are just not so good. But anyways, I'll be back once I've played these drills because I do want them to have the highest drills or best grades for the drills. So yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so we're back. As you can see, we got all A's. <laughs> Uh, so hopefully that improves some of our players that were trained right there and our first match is against Burnley Okay, now normally I wouldn't play this match, but considering it's our first match of the Premier League I think I might actually play it uh, Thomas Partey, what, what are you saying? Uh, good preseason, there are reasons for that. I wasn't feeling 100% but I'm over um, I'm But you're, you're still a key player. Yeah, because he definitely is 84 rated. Come on. We'll attend the per first ever press conference. Well, second ever press conference. I believe we had one just before the Community Shield where we lost. Ugh. I've got faith in these players. I go rather quick through these because I don't really mind. I just want to help the team morale get to as high as it can possibly, possibly be. And it's my job to make difficult decisions. Yep. Yeah, I think we'll do pretty well, hopefully. Um, let me just check on the team. There are some players are quite tired, but it's, it's fine. Um, Bellerin should be our captain. Yeah. Uh, yeah, David Luis is not playing. Um, I think we're good. Martinelli, Matthew Ryan, yeah, William, yeah, almost Mathurin. 
I'm putting uh, Emil Smith Rowe um, on the bench because I feel like I want to develop him more. I also want to develop Martinelli into a uh, star player, but that's for later. I was about to sim the match, but no, I'm playing this match even though we will probably lose even because I am not too good at FIFA. No, no. No, 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 no. Oh, great save from Bernal. Ugh, Bern Leno. Oh, Aubameyang, oh, Aubameyang, oh, I'm not sure how many clips I'm going to put into this first match, but oh my gosh, if you guys haven't noticed, I love playing uh, quick passing just like how Barcelona play, oh, especially when I play with FIFA, and honestly, it doesn't seem like I could do much of that with this team, at least f for some reason, I, I just, I just probably just don't have the right players for that, but Aubameyang! That wasn't Aubameyang. Who's number 15? Ceballos. I think it's Ceballos. No, wait. Ceballos is number... Wait. Oh, it's Kamara! Fam, I signed him and I completely forgot who he was. I get very panicky no matter how far the ball is. Oh, my. Even if the... If the opposing team has the ball far away from the goal oh what great play oh nicholas pepe oh nicholas pepe no oh that was on me that was on me that was on me oh bamiang party yes thomas party party we're having a party we're having a party hey hey thomas yes gets our first goal of the premier league season i really thought Aubameyang was gonna score but nope thomas gets the rebound hits it with his left and we get the goal that puts us in the lead against burnley oh hasn't been an easy game to be fair it hasn't it hasn't been an easy game but i mean come on we're leading we just we don't let this slip come on Oh, good stuff from TT. Just take it. Just take it. Is Martin Odegaard left footed or right footed? Is he left footed or right footed? Someone tell me. No! Damn it. A baby Yang. What? You got to get ahead of your marker. I'm a flimsy tackler. I don't know if that's actually a thing, but. Which means I, I just throw us into tackles, even though I shouldn't. Oh, no. Especially in the penalty box. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm. I knew that was going to happen. And it's just before the half. Of course it's just before the half. Was that Ross Barkley? Wait, I thought Ross Barkley played for Villa. No? I'm confused. Still, oh, Leno, it's it's right by your foot, dude. It's right by your foot. Oh. Who's? Oh, he looks like Ross Barkley. I, I I could be wrong, but he looks like Ross Barkley. So okay, I I might be crazy. And it's just before the half. There you go. Oh damn. Okay, it's not it's not the worst, but it's it's not the best. Oh, quite angry about that. It's one one. Odegaard, Odegaard, Odegaard. No, he's gone wide, he's gone wide, he's gone wide. No! What? Wait, hang on. Besides the whole drawing me of already to Real Madrid, I don't understand that. I, I'm confused as to what just happened. I made a foul? Odegaard. Oh. What you're telling me 
If I did make that foul, that's an own goal. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to shoot with Saka, but since he lost the ball, I guess it was attack. Darn it. Saka. Saka. Why not? Oh, that's why you don't. That's that's why not. Oh, I didn't have space, honestly. I, I don't know why I shot that. I had no space. What? I got it. I got a corner out of that. Okay. I mean, I'll take a corner. Abemiang! Someone just shoot it! Oh! Oh, oh what a ball! Oh! Oh, great defensive. Great defensive uh, block from um, uh, Gabriel. And yeah, I'll sub in Smith Row for Odegaard. Odegaard played pretty well, honestly. Emil Smith Rowe. Emil Smith Rowe. Emil Smith Rowe. Oh! Kamara. Kamara. Saka. Emil. Oh! Still your ball. Party. A bam yang! Aubameyang, can you stop getting dispossessed every time you get the ball? Oh no, oh my gosh, there's a massive opening. Oh, Leno, Leno, you are a very great player and I I appreciate you. Aubameyang in for Lacazette because, oh my gosh, you're infuriating me, man. Oh, I shouldn't have cut in like that. Oh, they have a lot of players, they have a lot of players, they have a lot of players. Kieran Tierney, Kieran Tierney. Kamara! That was Umtiti. I thought it was Kamara. Why? Kamara was just further up the pitch, I guess. Lacazette. Leave it off for Pepe. Oh, damn. Should have done the one, too. No! No! Ah! Oh! Damn! Damn! We might actually lose. This, tie this game. This is the very first game. Well, first game of the episode and first game of the Premier League, and we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. No! What? Well, not lose. Sorry. Tie against Burnley too, man. That was a great block, honestly. Oh, come on. Oh, Lacazette. Oh, Lacazette. So my webcam stopped working. And you guys missed my reaction to Emil Smith's row. Emil Smith row's miss at the very end of the game. Oh, my. <sighs> we ended up tying. I, uh, now we're in the press conference. I... Uh, I, yeah, uh, I'm disappointed. Okay, to be fair, it wasn't him, it was me. I shot it straight down the middle, I shouldn't. Uh, Partey played really well, I'm very impressed with him. Um, but, yeah, I'm disappointed we could have kept a clean sheet. Oh my gosh, I am, I don't know how to feel. I really don't know how to feel, that's, oh, uh, we should have won that game. We should have won that game. Damn. Oh, I'm quite angry about that. I'm, uh, hate being subbed off at the best of times. Uh, no. Actually, you probably could have you if you were in the position. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I need you to stay fit. Uh, it's just. Oh man, I'll think about it. Uh, I am. I'm quite sad that we we missed our chance right there. It's just. Ridiculous. I I should have won that. Whatever. I'll, I'll be back with when we're done with training and we'll submit. We'll go to the next match and we'll see if we'll play it or not. We'll be back. All right. So after crying a little bit inside from tying that match, uh, we're back away from home against Southampton. We are going to play this match yet again. I think we're going to see... 
a few matches uh, before an episode is over. I think we're gonna watch maybe five, and I might play two, maybe three. Depends on how I'm feeling. Right now I'm super tired, so we're not gonna play that much. <laughs> but this is how the team is looking. Saka grew by one, I think Tierney grew up by one. Um, Pepe grew by one, I believe, also, and so did Hector Bellerin, so pretty good. But still, oh, I'm still <laughs> reeling after that tie against Burnley, man. Oh, damn, we could have already been losing, but Bernano shows his class, man. I don't think he gets enough respect, man. He's a quality goalkeeper. As soon as I say that, as soon as, soon as I say he's a quality goalkeeper, to be fair, that was a really good shot from James Ward-Prowse. I think I wanted to sign it. I think he was in the transfer list, wasn't he? I think we should have signed him. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, he was all alone. Uh, <sighs> terrible, terrible defending for me. But come on, we, we still have a chance to win. Come on. Oh, ho, ho, ho. great connection between Aubameyang and Martin Odegaard. There we go. Martin o oh, my God, my voice. Martin Odegaard gets us our first goal. Well, what am I saying? Our first goal, but our first goal in this match and the equalizer. Let's go. Come on. Great. Like Aubameyang. Off to Martin Odegaard. They just get a little touch on it, but it doesn't matter. Martin Odegaard is still attacking the space and he gets us the goal. Let's go. Left foot. Is he a left footed player? I forgot to check. But great strike from Martin Odegaard. Let's go. Come on. Great tackle. Omtiti is playing so well, man. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me. Martin Odegaard! Oh! I think he is left-footed. Aubameyang just wasn't attacking the, the free space. I was waiting for him to... So he could be a bit backwards so I could cut it back to him. But he just wasn't there. Ooh, TT! TT! Aubameyang! Oh! Martin Odegaard and Aubameyang, again, the link of play between them is incredible. But Aubameyang this time is the scorer and um, Odegaard is the provider this time. They've swapped roles. Let's go! And we are now in the lead. Let's go, Arsenal. Let's go. Come on. We can keep it going. Let's keep it going. Come on. Aubameyang's first goal in the Premier League. Let's get it. I'm a big fan of wingers, but I just... Not sure if this will even make it. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, my. That was a big scare. Bamiang. I, I didn't know I had gold news on, but I guess. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 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 the Odegaard and Aubameyang connection is real. That's three goals created by both of them. And Odegaard has got two of them. Meanwhile, Aubameyang has assisted twice and scored once. And Odegaard has gotten, score has gotten two goals and one assist. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Wow. Their link up play is incredible. <laughs> oh, let's go. We have our new partnership. We have our new partnership. Oh, no. Oh, no. <sighs> Big mistake from Umtiti's pass, but I mean, well, from my pass, because that was a terrible pass, but Umtiti just cleans up. Oh, ah. Woo! Nicholas Pepe. Nicholas Pepe. You seen him? Bamiang's through. Bamiang's through. Bamiang's through. For a second goal of the game. For a second goal of the game. Mm. It's 4-1. Let's go. Bamiang. Bamiang. He's off the mark. He is off the mark. We are demolishing. Nah, maybe not demolishing. It's barely 4-1. Demolishing is once we get like a good 
five goal lead, but it's fine. It's fine. Let's go. Aubameyang gets a second of the game and of the whole Premier League campaign. Oh, Aubameyang's through again, and it was another Odegaard pass. Can he finish it? No, he cannot. Oh. Oh, all right. Good half. Good half. Good half. Started off down, but now we're four one up. Let's let's go. Let's go. Oh, I think maybe sack of anything would be a nominee to get off. Gabriel versus Che Adams and completely forgot his name. Um. Ah, I forgot his name. Oh. Woo. Good save, good save, good save. I forgot his name. Uh, Danny Ings. There you go, Danny Ings. Block it. Nope, that's not blocking. That's not blocking. Ooh. It's 4-2 and they're back in the game. Che Adams. Che Adams. Wow. Okay. Okay. They're, they're definitely back in the game. This is scary. This is very scary. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's one goal. I, well, I skipped the... It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I really want a hat trick from either Bamiang or Odegaard. Looks like it could be a Bamiang. If he gets into the right space, and he has. Oh, as long as they don't follow him. A Bamiang! Oh, it's wide. Oh, it's wide. Oh, a Bamiang. A Bamiang! I want more security. Two goals is not, <laughs> not enough security. I maybe just be greedy. Okay, Odegaard, he's held up well. Aubameyang, finish that this time. There we go, he grabs his hat trick. And Odegaard gets his second assist of the match. Let's go, it's 5-2. Aubameyang with a hat trick. A hat trick. Mm. I'm, I'm telling you this, Odegaard and Aubameyang connection is just, it's just fire. It's, it's lightning, it's electricity. Wow, what a finish. What a finish. Bang. And that's the Bamiyang that we need. That's the Bamiyang that I love. Come on! He's already got three goals in two matches. To be fair, the first match was not... Um, did not go as planned. But, I mean, the second one has... Uh, again, not perfect, but pretty good. If they score two, we can score seven. That's the mentality we have here. Okay, not really, but <laughs> we have the mentality of just keep going, keep scoring as much as you can. Can we get another goal? Can we get Saka or even Emil Smith Rowe a goal? That's my question. Oh, what a ball in! Uh, I should have crossed it in. The... Every time, every time. No way, Burnley's beating Leeds. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Weird, but good save from Bern Leno. Oh, Bamiang. Oh, Bamiang. I forgot he's played on the left wing. He's played on the left wing. Can he take it all the way? Can he take it all the way? He's alone. Emma Smith Row. Nope. Doesn't matter. 5 2 victory for Arsenal. Let's go. Yeah. And Bamiang. Six attempts, three goals. Not bad at all for. Our main man, Pierre Emmerich Aubameyang. Good job on him. Hat trick for him. Also, great performance from Odegaard. Their connection is outstanding. I know we can always score goals. Again, that's not the best. Dang. I want, I want us to be very happy. All of us. The team morale, I want them to be very happy. Um, some more training drills that I might have to take on. We're in fourth place after two matches. Um, yeah, we're going to have to do a few training drills. I'll be back. For the next match yeah um, I think I might quick sim this next match depending on which match it is if it's a very tough match I might play it or I might save it until the next episode but yeah all right so we're back we're facing Leeds who are actually in 20th after two matches so yeah we'll, we'll quick sim this match hopefully we can come away with the win um, there has, been, there has been a bit of development. I think we might sell Lacazette and we might bring in, um, I forgot his name, Daniel Mallon, because I feel like he's younger. He'll bring in 
some youth, more youth into the squad, and hopefully it'll replace a Bamiyang when a Bamiyang just starts to drip, um, drop down in overall. So let's quick sim this match. Um, hopefully we've won it. I'm fingers. Uh, of course, of course, we did. A Bamiyang <laughs> got a goal, but some player named Mata got two goals. Is that Jaime Mata? Saka. I think I might. Oh my god, Saka's just not playing well, man. Mm. Mm -hmm. So, after three matches, we've drawn one, won one, and lost one. So we're smacked up in the middle. Nelson, no, not for, I, yeah, with not, no, no, no. That's for sure rejected. I'll loan him out, but I'm not, with, not with an option to buy. So it's either Lazio or Olympic Leonese, which is where he came from. And we might bring in this guy, Daniel Mellon. He's 21, 79 overall, so only three overall less than um, Lacazette. Lacazette, 82 rated, um, but he's much older. So, yeah. As for the training, um, can't see a loan offer. Nah, I, wanna, I honestly want to keep him because I, I'm i scared that we might get a striker injury. Like, so we just get to sim past these rather easily and we have Newcastle up next I wonder how they're doing oh another training day I didn't even notice um what's this match reschedule ah we don't care so we'll just I believe I believe Arsenal are in the Europa League so hopefully we can win that match and that's just in case we don't make it into the top four because I'm not sure if we're gonna be good because I'm a better FIFA player and these teams seem not to be the best. Ooh, ooh, okay. Lazio seem, ooh, but oh, should I wait? Should I wait for the Olympic Leone? Because it says possible 50 million. I mean, 43 isn't the worst either. I'm gonna wait a little bit. I'm gonna keep this right there. Um, after this match, I'll check it out. If, if they come in saying, Oh, I just realized we only have two more days after this match. So maybe I will just accept the Lazio offer because I think we'll, we'll still have enough money. Uh, what's the group that we're in? There's a lot of groups. So we have, wow, thank you, FIFA. I, I was waiting for a simulation, but I completely forgot to click. So we're in group E, I believe. I'm facing Nice, Braga, and Royal Antwerp. Okay, it's not, it's not the worst, it's not the worst. Oh, I forgot the Europa League takes longer because there's Timo. Sorry, I, I get in one thought and then another. But anyways, Aubameyang is top scorer with four goals. Good on him. Jao Moutinho, quite surprising. Firmino, also surprising. And Werner, also surprising. I... Okay. <laughs> quite a few su surprises on the top scorers list, but I mean... It's not, not a matter. Um, so anyways, Newcastle are in a left, oh my gosh, I didn't see them, <laughs> they're just below us. So this is an important match. Um, I'm gonna simulate it, I'm gonna sim the match. We're away from home, we're gonna simulate the match against Newcastle. Sorry, my webcam come out, cut out for a little bit. And if it cuts out again, then I might have to go over to a voiceover for the last um, few minutes of this video, but hopefully it doesn't. Um, we're just gonna watch this match. Hopefully, something interesting happens. Um, yeah, I think this will be the last match of the of the episode, and we'll leave it off until the next one. The guard, nice. Saka, maybe something. A goal. We are dominating the match. If you look at the stats. Oh, Bamian. Seventy-two percent possession in twenty minutes. Not bad at all. And one shot, one shot on target. Ah. Uh, so it looks like Kamara and Thomas are playing the best out of our team. Oh, oh! Aubameyang, Odegaard, back to Kamara. Thomas Porte. Oh, Odegaard! Oh, Odegaard is playing well. So our whole midfield is playing well. Okay. Oh, and they hit the post. Wow, we are still dominating, but wow. We'll go into the second half. Hopefully things improve. By that I mean we score goals. Oh, Bamiyang! Yes! 
Aubameyang gets us our first goal. Let's go. I say first. Hopefully we score more goals. But yes, that's five for him. Wow, he could end up being the top goal scorer. Oh, Nicolas Pepe. Thought he's going to cross it in. Nope. Oh. 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 I know I didn't see it. Like, I didn't see the actual player doing it, but I saw the little ball, and wow. I think he dribbled past like two there and then scored the goal. Oh no, 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 no. But it gives us a comfortable 2-0 um, lead. So, yes, I am very happy about this. 2-0, uh, no. maybe three, maybe three. Nah, I think the game's just about over. Yeah, it's just about over. Corner kick. Maybe we can get a last minute goal, but I doubt it. Oh, maybe? Nope. Yeah, it's over. Yeah, there it is. Let's go. 2 0 victors up against Newcastle United. Pretty, pretty dominant game, in my opinion, but very good job. Nicolas Pepe and Nabemian with the goals. Mm, Man United big leads. Um, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. So, two wins, one draw, and one loss. Not the worst. And what broke down? Olympic Leon. Okay, so that means we can still go in for Lazio, please, hopefully. Yes, we can. Okay, so we accept that offer. Oh no, will we have enough days? Will we have enough days to sign Daniel Mallon? That's my question. Oh, we're on deadline day. We're about to be on deadline day. Stay tuned. Stay tuned because this is getting interesting. So obviously we brought in that many players. Goretzka to Barcelona. We'll check out the top deals in a minute. Please tell me sold. Like I said, sold. Okay. Okay, okay, we might, yep, okay, okay. Now, this is the moment of truth. Will we be able to sign Daniel Mellon? Yes, we will. Okay, it's from 46 to about 65 million. We have just under 65 million, so I think we should be able to sign him. 55 with the 15% sell-on clause. Um, I'm gonna remove the sell-on clause and we'll go to 50, yeah, 50 million. So we'll raise our offer by 6 million. It's a reasonable offer. And we've got Malin in the bag. I know he cost him more than what we sold um, Lacazette for. But I mean, he is younger and he's just around the same overall. So, Plus he's got pretty good potential. I believe his potential is 86. Spirat. That is not what I expected, but sure. Yeah, so he won't get complain. Five years, please. Please, five or four years. All right, he'll take five years. Um... Okay, yeah, no release clause. I don't like release clauses. Sorry, my webcam cut off for a little bit. But anyways, um, so yeah, we lowered, we raised it up to 60, but removed the bonus and hopefully he accepts. He has accepted and we now have a new number nine. I know he's lower rated than Lacazette. I know I'm gonna hear it, but whatever. I am happy. Oh, auto got good to the 84? Okay. Um, Last thing I want to do is just change. Oh, he already has a number nine. Okay, all good. Okay, Aubameyang is at 85. So my webcam cut off again. <laughs> but anyways, so we do have our new backup striker, Daniel Mallon. We have moved him up about. I'm with Smith Rose unhappy, but hopefully we can change that. I do want him being covered a little more. I want Martinelli to be covered a little more. Willian, I want him gone, but no offers came in for him, I believe. <laughs> yeah, kind of sucks, but. I think this is where we're gonna leave off the video because I mean, what a pretty good, decent, an average, average episode to be fair. Um, wow, Chelsea brought in Arabi and Puertas. They, they sold Mason Mount. Okay, interesting, 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 interesting. Uh, we brought in Kamara, Umtiti, and Malin. While well, we sold Lacazette. Yes. Um, any other interesting? Uh, Everton brought in Sanchez and Marosic and left Sigurdsson. Uh, Leicester City, bye bye to Albrighton and Vardy. Meanwhile, bringing in Stones and Dulart. Uh Liverpool brought in Decore and Moreno. Uh, Munayin, Romagnoli, and Josh Sargent. Meanwhile, they got rid of Stones. Wow. Hmm, that's an interesting team, that's for sure. They got rid of Bailey and Shaw. 
Friday is mainly Corona and Coats, Coates or whatever. Kimfrolier, Benanho, baby. Oh, they brought in baby. Okay. Um, I think Spurs is the last match. Last match. Last. Oh, they brought in Varane and got rid of Lamella. Anyways, let's check out the top deals real quick. Vlad Goretzka, Federico Valverde, Jimmy Vardy, Rafael Varane, Sergio Busquets. Jose Gaia, Rafa, Monain, this is Corona, well, wait, Horst, Jared Moreno, Guedes, Mason, oh, they went to Dortmund, hmm. Real Magnolia, and Anfield Correa, these are some other, oh, he's up there, hey, <laughs> anyways, we're gonna leave off the video right here, uh, let me just sim right past this day because I'm not gonna do any other um, transfer deals I guess but yeah as you can see we have this Europa League game coming up in this month and wow these are actually very big games we have Manchester United then within the same week we play a Europa League game then we have Everton and then within the same week we play a cup against I don't even know what that club is and then Liverpool yeah it's gonna be interesting this next episode is gonna be very interesting I think we might play four matches possibly yeah. anyways um this has been a pretty good episode i've already said that um we'll check out these things later and with that i'll see you guys later all right late